Hey coach, welcome back to the channel. So today I want to talk about three ways that you can improve your training business. Now, if you implement these three things that I'm about to share with you today, I can guarantee you that it will bring in an extra two to five K per month with your business. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is you want to gather information, right? So you want to gather either testimonials or you want to gather success stories of current clients that you're working with. I see so many coaches at the moment who don't have testimonials either on their website or their social media page. Now, when you've got testimonials and when you've got success stories that you can share on either your social media platforms or your website, this starts to build trust with any new parent that, that comes across any of those two platforms. Okay, so on those testimonials, you want to make sure that if you do a video of the client speaking, then you want to make sure that 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 client is talking about where they were at before they started working with you and how your program has helped them in X amount of time that they've been with you. Okay, so that's one way. Then another way would be to, you can either take a screenshot of the client, upload it onto the website or your social media, and in the description of that, that picture, you can explain where that client was when they first joined your program and how they've improved over the period of the time that they've been with you. Right, so the first way to improve your business is by showing social proof, which is through either testimonials or success stories. Now, the second way to improve your business is by setting up a referral program. Now, with the coaches we work with in our Sports Accelerator program, what we do is we help them to set up monthly referral programs that they then follow through and implement into the business. Now, a coach that successfully implements this will see a growth in their, in their income per month anywhere between 1 to 5K. Okay? Because what you start to do is when you, when you start to build a referral program and like-minded clients are coming into your business, then ultimately you start to attract committed clients. Okay, so if you've got clients currently that you've been working with for three, six, or even 12 months, you want to set up a referral program with them where if they refer any like-minded family into your business and that family joins, then you offer an incentive to them for that referral. Okay, now the likelihood that when someone that has been a long committed client in your business, the likelihood that they're going to then refer someone who is like minded like them will be quite high. Okay, so instead of going out into the marketplace and talking to random, random parents who you don't know what they're going to be like when they first join you, connect with your current clients and set up a referral program with them, reach out to them once a month, maybe at the end of the month, give them an update on how their child is doing within your program, and then talk to them about your referral program coming up, okay, and why, if they refer someone into you, they can gain a, a financial benefit from that referral, okay. So the first two, go over them again. The first one is setting up testimonials or client success stories in e on either your social media page or your website. Now, the second one is setting up a referral a type of system or program within your business where you're reaching out to your current clients who have been in your program or who are currently part of your program and setting up a referral program with them where if they refer any like-minded parents into your business and they join, they get a percentage off their upcoming package, their upcoming payment, 
or any camp or clinic that you have coming up running. Okay. Now, the third one is a way to improve your business is making sure that all your platforms are up to date. So by platforms, I mean your website, your social media, okay, your you're sending emails out on a regular basis, okay, because what parents like to see is they like to see consistency. And if you are a consistent business owner, then you will start to attract consistent clients into your business. So when a new parent comes across your website, okay, and they reach out to you, and then they don't hear any response back because you're, you haven't been up to date with your, your email or the way you gather information and follow up with leads, then ultimately, ultimately you might lose that, that new business coming in, right? It's the same when a, a new parent lands onto your, your social media, okay, your, either your Instagram or your Facebook, and they check to see when's the last time you posted. If the last time you posted was over three, four, five, seven months ago, then ultimately that parent's going to be thinking, right, this, this coach isn't in business anymore because they're not consistent, they're not up to date. Okay, so you might lose someone then falling into your funnel and going through the process to sign, sign up to either join an evaluation session or register onto one of your upcoming Campbell clinics. Okay. So those are three ways that you can implement ways into your, your business in, in order to improve it and get new clients, get new referrals and grow and scale your business to the next level. Now, if you need any help with the three things that I've shared with you, take advantage of a free 15 to 20 minute call that I'm offering. If you visit the Canly link in the description below, you can book that through Canly. Click on the link and you can book a, a free call with me where we jump on Zoom, ask you a couple of questions, see where you're asked, see where you want to get to. Okay, and I can show you some actionable steps to take this week to grow and scale. If you don't want to do that, then you can send me an email to makemoneycoachingsports at gmail.com. Okay, thank you for watching. And if you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with all our latest content.